Good evening, everyone. Today we are talking about sentence correction and rule number two. So let us take a quick look. Rule two deals with sentences containing words each of, one of, and none of. Sentences with words like each of. Each of the girl or girls, one of the boy or boys, none of the student or students. Well, confusing. No, if you will not be confused now. So each of, one of, and none of is always supported by a plural form of noun. Right? Each of the students, each of the girls, none of the boys. The first, the second rule. These words will always follow a plural form of noun. Let us take a look at the examples. <clears throat> Each of the incorrect sentences Each of the player played well in the match. No. This is an incorrect sentence. Each of the player played well in the match. So where is the error? The correct form is each of the players. Now here you have the players. Each of the players played well. Each of the players played well. It means Sare players may say Sare Sabne Acha Khela. Each of the players, Sare Kisari team members, Sare players ne Acha Khela. So the player is converted into a plural now. Second, one of the incorrect sentences, one of the girl went home. अब यहां पर लगेगा वन ऑफ द गर्ल वेंट होम एक लड़की घर गई है तो ये इसमें रॉन्ग क्या है कंफ्यूज्ड यस वन ऑफ द गर्ल नॉर्मली क्या होता है सब्जेक्ट देखते हैं वन है वन ऑफ द गर्ल वेंट होम एक लड़की गई है तो टोरल तो होगा नहीं सिंगुलर होगा बट नहीं वन ऑफ द गर्ल्स बहुत सारे लड़कियों में से एक घर गई है The correct sentence is one of the girls went home. One of the girls went home. None of. Koi bhi ne, kisi ne bhi nahi. Incorrect sentence. None of the students scored above 70% in exam. None of the students scored. Jitne bhi students class mein thi. Kisi ne bhi 70% se zyada score nahi kya. So none of the students scored above 70% marks. Again is wrong. Check for the noun. Here the, the, the noun here is student. And student is singular so it is wrong. So the correct form will be none of the students scored. None of the students scored above 70% marks. So this was rule number two. And we'll come up with the next slide. Next class is rule number three. We talk, we'll be talking about a collective noun. The collective noun takes a plural verb when not used in a singular unit. How that is done? Let us take a look in the next class. So that's all for now. Take care and bye-bye.